Check this out. Hello, Blim City citizens. That's Club Nugman, Blim City magistrate. As you all know, I'm working hard to flush out all the crime and drugs from our streets. Now catch this next bit. All about to change. We've learned of a bold bounty hunter who's been bravely taking this G3 matter into their own hands. Bounty hunter, if you're listening, please consider joining forces with the good people of Blim City. Yeesh, desperate much? Can he even help us? I already told him you go. Oh, great. Oh, no, God. don't start. Trust me, he's legit. This guy's been anti G3 since before any Gus? of you were even in diapers. Honestly, I don't know I if can't, Gatlin's I can't even wear diapers. I say we hear him out. Gus, what do you have to say? Okay, cool. Hey, real quick, I just want to thank all of you for helping the channel reach 100 subscribers. It means a lot to see that you believe in the content on this channel, and if you aren't subscribed, consider hitting the subscribe button. It's free, and you can always unsubscribe later. Thank you all for your support. Enjoy the video. Thank you so much for coming, Bounty Hunter. I'll cut to the chase. I need your help. You survived the G3's attack on your home planet Earth, right? Yeah, they're a human. We're Gatlians. Of course. Sorry. I'm familiar with your plight as well. It's such a tragedy what happened on Gatlas. It makes much sense that you and the human would join forces, but perhaps you have room for one more ally as well? A lawless Bounty Hunter teaming up with a squeaky clean politician. <laughs> That's precisely why I need your help. I'm having the darndest time curbing this species drug trade. I can only do so much and only within the confines of the law. You've taken out two top G3 officers in less time than it takes us to file a single report. So you see how you can help me, but there's also one way I can help you. This tool on my desk here will help you rescue your fellow humans. You can use it to teleport them to a safe haven my team has arranged for them to stay at until the G3 are dealt with. Let me get this straight. You're giving this to us for free. Well, the human species is technically a drug. I can't have dangerous sentient drugs in the hands of my citizens, and you can't have your people getting captured and consumed. This solves both of our problems, assuming you plan to continue taking out the G3. That's right. This means a lot to me. I've made it my life's work to use my power to help people in need, but even I have my limits. As a token of thanks, my team will be feeding any intel we find on the G3 directly to your handler, Mr. Zaruthian. We've already sent him everything we had. The rest is in your hands. That's all I have for you. Feel free to stay as long as you like. The view is breathtaking. And we're back. So, oh, it went well, huh? I got a message saying they'll hook us up with any G3 intel they find. God damn, you got it easy. Nothing as convenient as this ever happened when I was bounty hunting. Hey, uh, speaking of, we should get you a jetpack before you head back out into the field. Head on down to the pawn shop and see if they got one in stock. We're looking for a jetpack. A jetpack? Oh, certainly. I can help. Uh, I can help. Really phenomenal choice. Let's lock that purchase in. Oh, so where's the jetpack? Not so fast. I gotta back order that bad boy. I'll have it ready for you in a couple of days, I promise. No refunds, by the way. This purchase is final. You! How'd it go? Did you get a jetpack? No. Yeah, but Mr. Keith's got it on back order, so we gotta wait. Great. Perfect excuse for a rest. We're still waiting on Clug's intel anyway. Aren't you? If you yeah, Go to you bed need to sleep yeah, off some of that excitement. I'm a little drowsy. I can use a little sleep myself. Hey, good night, partner. I'm just gonna sit right here and watch you fall asleep. You know, I, I think I think we're doing something amazing here. How cool would it be if we actually stopped the G3? Sorry, sorry. I'm I, I, I'm just I'm excited. I'll shut up. L let's get some sleep. Pretty soon, you know, we'll be jetpacking across all of space. Sorry, all I'm, space. I'm being too loud. You're probably trying to. Let's get you to sleep. Yeah, yeah. It's Go, let's go to sleep. Obtain the jetpack. Are you packing? All right, partner. Let's take this jetpack for a spin. Holy sh! This rules! I gotta tell you, Gene was right. Reach? That oh. is gonna come in handy. It's also fun. You could fly while doing combat. It's a very cool uh, feature that we have here. We put a lot of time and effort into it. Let's head back and talk to Gene and see if there's any new bounties. This place is a mess. I need you to clean it up before Tweet gets here. Oh, got a big date with your sad sack Flimborg boy toy? F*** off, Gene, like you've even never been on a date. Hey, don't even start, sister. I know a lot about dates. I f*** more aliens than your brain could comprehend. And even I don't want to touch your boyfriend. So sick of hearing about this guy. Yeah, right. 
My boyfriend is so f***ing hot, though, right? This guy's a loser. He is so hot. He's like a low seven or a high six. And he's really nice to me. Yeah, no ulterior motives there. I'm just saying you barely know this guy. Most aliens only bang their own species. Oh, what about you? You just said you've slept with basically everything in the whole galaxy. Yeah, but I'm a washed-up degenerate. You've got your whole life ahead of you. That's more condescending than it is sweet. What? No, look, we've spent all this time living together. I, I care about you now, Leslie. For f sake, my name's Lizzie. Come on, <laughs> tell her I care about her. Oh my God. I am not about to let this f up degenerate school me on life decisions. The fact that I'm a f up degenerate is exactly why you should let me school you on life decisions. I just don't tweak to think I'm messy, okay? It's that simple. And I don't want you dating him at all. Why don't I set you up with my nephew, Grimble Dick? He's got a steady job. F*** off. Just grow up and get used to me and Tweak. Sorry to drag you into all that. A nice little arrangement with Clug is paying off. They sent us intel on two new bounties. So, uh, go ahead if you want to get started on those. A moblet! What are you doing here? It's you! You know it, bud. Where's the rest of your crew? Everyone else got enslaved again, if you can believe it. Honestly, I think they like being enslaved. Everyone's got their kink. Where can we find them? They're working at Screndo Labs now. Just past the Mushroom Valley here. What's up? How you doing, Gus? Someone just come in? Sorry, I'm in the john. Oh, hold on. Don't, don't pass through here. I've got to make you signs and forms. Just one sec. Hey, we don't have to wait for this guy. Let's just open the door on our own. Nah, nah. He, he, needs, to, he needs to do all that. We can wait. Hey, you, you haven't left yet, right? Because it's its really important I get you checked in. And it's also really important that I finish Yeah, no, no, you're, you're good, man. You're good. I got okay. you. Okay, actually, I'm having a really rough time. J -j Just sit tight. Yeah, no, okay, that's fine. Okay, okay yeah, this isn't wrapping up anytime soon. Uh, hey, buddy, may maybe maybe you just want to take a nap? Uh, yeah, go ahead and just lie down on the floor and, and, and rest up while I... Well, I continue uh, and then no, when I'm done I'll, I'll wake you up, okay? Uh, sound good? Thank yeah, you. Yeah, no problem. No problem, man. You have fun with that. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna lie on the floor and take a nap. Okay. Wake me up when you're when you're finished. In here? Yeah. Hello and welcome to Scranda Labs. Only authorized personnel are allowed beyond this point. Oh! You're the bounty hunter who helped us out with all that paperwork and killed my boss, Krubus. <laughs> we really appreciated that. But sorry, I need to let the G3 know that you're here. Just my job, nothing personal. You're gonna set off the alarm. Yep, I'm gonna set off the alarm. We've got an intruder. G3 are coming for you. Sorry, it's my job. G3 coming our way, but those elevators are calling our names. Whoa! Hey, you. Would you like to do the honors? We're going to try to show up those cocky nerds in the weapons lab by fusing this human with some other aliens. Just hit the button. So you just let anybody come in here and help with experiments? I'm going to be honest. We're not qualified. I can do it myself if you don't want to. I'm just trying to be nice. <sighs> fuck it. What do we got to lose? Oh, that's creepy as fuck. Oh, my gosh. It's following me. Oh, that's creepy. Uh... I can look at that a little more and I can look at that. So I guess this. Boom! Oh, hmm. That wasn't supposed to happen. You hit the button. It's on you. That was on you. I don't know what you're talking about. I did nothing. I was not a part of this. This was all that person's Sorry, fault. Not killing this one. You're not you're not yeah. Um okay, cool. Ah, this way? Okay. Me, man. They're messing with Gatlians. Ah. Is hey, this hey, a Gatlian? Hey, hey, Creature feature. Obtain creature. Oh, hey! You look nice! My name's Creature. The bad guys did experiments on me and f***ed me up real bad in basically every way you can imagine. Holy sh**. Am I glad to see another Gatlian alive in here? Uh, are there any others? Oh my god, yes! There's so many! Oh, but unless you've been alive, then no. Creature, we're taking on the cartel. You want in? Oh, no, no, no. They take good care of me. Holding me against my will, cutting me open, doing experiments on me. Okay, you know what? Say it out loud. I think they might actually be bad. <laughs> I'm part of your team now. Hell yeah. Welcome aboard, <laughs> uh, creature. That, 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 that's your name? I guess 
so don't freak out or anything. I can give birth to a bunch of little freaks and they can disable the door lock. It's fine. Oh, yeah. Ah, beautiful. Look out, one of my little fuckers just saved us. <laughs> Uh, okay, let's do this. Get him, army! Get him, little army of kids! Get him! They used to outnumber me. Now they don't! They don't outnumber me anymore! I am Minnie! Minnie is me! I am Minnie! Minnie is me! Okay. I got you. Go! 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 That was my one. Oh. Well, this thing's pretty nice. I bet all the humans are happy here. We get 12 full meals a day. None of us have the heart to tell them we don't need to eat that much. This place? I don't know. This place is cool. They gave us free air massages. Yeah, I keep telling them it's not really something that humans like, but they keep offering them, so I keep thanking them. <laughs> I'm Jonathan Strendel, aka uh -oh. the Hot Strendel. That's brother. the human haven. I'm yeah. Yours. Oh, hey, Jonathan. I think we're going to kill you. <laughs> Jonathan Sprindle. Whoa. Whoa, what the fuck? Hey, don't so damn it. I got a real pretty face, and I want to keep it that way. Oh, I'm not gonna die here. Oh, I'm not. There he goes. Well, we tried. Time to throw in the towel and let ourselves get captured, I guess. Tell my wife. I'm actually Hollywood superstar Steve Buscemi. Hey, Brad. What do they got you watching today? Uh, I guess it's supposed to be porn, but it's like alien porn, so I, I don't know. I, I honestly have no idea what I'm watching. I mean, I was able to get off to it, like, after a while. Um, honestly, now I love it, though. I, I like it a lot, actually. I mean, if, if I ever get out of here, I, I hope I... Oh, what the hell? What, what is this? What is this? Why is this in here? I'm trying to jack off. Hi, Angela. Are you going to keep running? I wasn't running. Oh, our misunderstanding. Whatever. Up, you Angela Sprindle. Uh, -oh. uh, you know, earlier you saw me running, I wasn't really running, you know? I was just late for a meeting in this room. Hey, what the, are you the one that's been causing a big hubbub around here? Fuck you. The Scrindle Think Tank? Mona Scrindle. The creature's just too good. I can really just combo him with this. Like... That... Oh! The Brotron? Oh gosh, Brotron! Okay, that's a little more intimidating. Wait a minute, look at Brotron. Look at their health. Oh my, oh no! Okay, you need to target one, take them down very quickly. Oh, they're going back to Brotron. Okay. I'm gonna die! You've gotta be kidding me! Don't oh, give me a break! Creature, I need your mind control! Why does Creature never have mind control available? Oh my gosh, Jonathan's dead! Take that, you scrub! Take that! Big piece of sh. Yeah. Carmen. That's right. <laughs> I know who you are, and I want you to know how f you've made things for yourself. You were living in heaven before you meddled with the G3. <laughs> oh, okay, that sounds bad. Bounty hunter. Oh, I've got the two most important people in your life. 
should have to redo the fight. Oh my god. But not right away. First, I'll make things miserable for them. They're going to suffer as much as you've made me suffer. Uh oh! Besides, you won't even be able to get to my new base on Earth without the proper coordinates. So just sit tight until I come to kill you myself. Sorry, bounty hunter. We'll stop him, I promise. Yo, you guys are fresh out of Friendelos. Who the oh. fuck? Hey, I I'm Twig. I'm dating your sister. Oh, this fucking guy. Twig, you need to leave. Um, Lizzie says it's cool if I'm here. You're just gonna let this sack of shit eat all my Friendelos and tongue kiss your sister? I'm the one who bought those fucking Friendelos. And leave Twig alone. You know he has a barbed tongue and he's very sensitive about it. Hey, Twig, you gotta be careful around Lizzie. She's just gonna hit it and quit it. Don't you have a galaxy to fuck? Come on, tell him to leave. Oh my gosh! Why do I have to do this? Why are you just staring at us? I, because I'm so tired of making your decisions for you! Thank you. I appreciate it. But honestly, it's my house too. So I don't even know why I have to fight for this. I'm just so pissed at everyone. And me? Oh, not you, Twig. I love you, baby. Ah! Disgusting! Look at this! They're not even the same species! Do you know how many holes he has? And they're all really advanced level holes. You really gotta take my nephew instead. His holes are more your speed. Hey, look, you Shut wanna kill something? Up, we I might, we might... Look, you, you hey, look, I know, th I know this. Gatlion wants to kill someone. I really know this one wants to do this. So, uh... Let's just kill me. I'm pathetic. That's my whole deal. I'm homeless and legless and probably riddled with mental illnesses, which I'd know for sure if I didn't think therapy was a fake idea. You don't need to rub it in. I'll rub it in all I want. You're like 80 years old. You can't take a little shit talking from a teenage girl. Jesus, I'm not 80. I'm 230. And that's really young for my species. I just don't want your creep boyfriend to steal my couch. You can call it your couch when you start paying rent. Until then, no complaining about who lives here. Lives here? He's gonna live here? I mean, if you think we're ready, Tweed. Oh, yeah, sure. Hey, shut up, Tweed. This isn't about you.